Shane Catchy and Muth near and racing up towards the line. This is a brilliant performance by Batash and Batash giving them a right bashing in the King George, a back-to-back -back win. Kick three lengths clear, heading down towards the last furlong and she's stretching further away from threading and voracious Alpha Centauri pounding clear on the run to the line. Unable and magical and they're well clear of the others. Racing royalty, Unable and Frankie de Torre. The art winner is the Breeders' Cup turf winner too. By two lengths, just about holding on that advantage all the way up towards the line. And it's going to be an 11th Hardwick Stakes for Sir Michael Stout. Chris Lotion wins. Then Mendelssohn, Ganavera, and Yoshida on the far outside. They're coming to the wire and accelerate wins the Breeders' Cup Classic. Roaring lights gone after him on the outside. They're racing now towards the finish. And it's Saxon Warrior, Roaring Line, the arch rivals. Roaring Line gets up to win it. Poets Word and it's Poets Word of James Doyle. Cracksman in second place trying hard, but Poets Word will lower his colours and make history for Sir Michael Stout. Running on third, but Gunrunner the advantage, and Gunrunner is starting to draw Kia the final 16, and Gunrunner a superb performance in the Classic. From Garlow's shop, and here's her second Queen Elizabeth. This is a silver jubilee moment on the throne for 25 consecutive wins. Cracksman, he's absolutely relentless. It's seven, eight, let's clear. Frankie saluting the crowd. Her second champion stakes, and what a champion he is.